guys, it's Alex and I'm back here again today with a new video. This video is going to be my November favorites. And I know, I apologize for the lighting, I apologize for my voice, I am currently super congested. And I'm very sorry that I haven't filmed a video in like 2-3 months. I've just been really sloppy, I know that. But hopefully I'm going to be filming a new video every week. Not making any promises, but I'm going to try. So, without further ado, let's get started. I'm going to be doing a separate video for my music favorites of November, so look out for that one. That's going to be my next video. But right now we're doing my clothes and just other things that I've really enjoyed in November. So the first thing I've really enjoyed is this jacket. It's more of like a... Um, it's a long jacket, but it's like not super long. And I got it from Century 21. I think it was like originally for like 400 bucks, but at Century 21 I got it for a super great price, which is like it was like 60. So that was awesome. I got it like a year ago, so I'm pretty sure they don't have it anymore. Sorry. Next favorite is this jacket from Free People. I got it last year for Christmas and I don't know if they still have it. I'm not too sure. I, I mean I would check. But yeah, it's super cute. It's furry. It makes me feel like a shaggy dog. You know the movie with Tim Allen and he's the shaggy dog? That's what it makes me feel like. In, in a good way, you know? So my next favorite for this one is this sweater. And I got it from my aunt, like, last year. Everything, I don't know, for some reason, I get a lot of these things from last year. And I'm just, like, re-wearing them this this fall. But, like, I really like this sweater. It's, like, a, a grayish blue and it has, like, little white specks in it. The only downside about this sweater is that it's, like, a little, a little scratchy, a little itchy. But, you know, that's okay. I'm totally fine with that. My next favorite shirt of November is this shirt here, this thermal shirt, from The Messy Heads. Um, I will link their Instagram below because I really, really love them. They're awesome. Uh, so yeah, I like this. It just says here on the front of the little heart, it says Messy Club. And then on the back, it says Club Messy Code of Conduct. And it just says stuff like, take the morning slow. Feel comfortable in bare skin, write about your days, be true to yourself, spread positivity, smile, smile often, be grateful, stay aware, and fall in love hard. I think that's a really nice code of conduct to look by. Yeah, it's super it's super comfortable. They don't sell this shirt anymore, but I think they're currently selling their their um their like winter sweatshirt right now, so Sorry if you like the shirt, you can't get it anymore, but you should um, you should get their new sweatshirt because it's bomb, you know? Alright, okay, let's bomb. My next favorite for November is this skirt. It's like, it's cute, it's black, it's fringe, it's, and it's from Forever 21. I originally got it to go to a funeral, but the guy who the funeral was for, he was always really lit and popping, you know, feel me? He's always super happy and whatever. So I feel like why not get a super lit skirt to go to a super lit funeral, you feel me? And it was a super lit funeral, um... I mean, not the fact that it was a funeral, that's very sad, but... What can you do? Yeah, so it's cute, it's black, it's fringe... It's fantastic. My next favorite for November is this halter bralette from Urban Outfitters. They they have these, um, the halter bralettes at Free, free People too. But I just got this one from Urban because I was in Urban one day and I'm just like, hey, I need, I want one, so I got it. You feel me? It's like cute, it's purple. I plan on getting the other, other colors too, but I don't have them as of yet. But I, I want, I'm gonna get them. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> My next favorite is this shirt from Zara. It was like 16 bucks, and that's originally why I got it. I got it to wear to Thanksgiving because I like to say super casual for Thanksgiving and this was just it. This is, it's soft, it's comfy, and just for, it's like, it just screamed the 90s to me, you know, so I got it and I like it a lot. It's not cropped or anything, you know, it does look a little cropped. 
Okay, so now I've done all my clothing tape. <laughs> Anyway, I've got all my clothing favorites now, and now I'm moving on to other stuff. So, what the fuck is wrong with you? Get, get out! Get out! I got these last year for Thanksgiving from Topshop, and they were like 80 bucks, and they're cute. They're just like basic high-heeled booty, ankle booties. They're not the most comfortable shoes. I wouldn't wear these if you knew you were going to be walking all day, but like, say like if I'm getting picked up from school that day, I would wear these. So, but they're cute. I've got lot, lots of compliments on them, and that's cool. Ah! Okay. So my next favorite is jewelry, and I got this necklace. I don't know if you can see it, but I'll put a close up. Of, I'll put a close up of it. Um, it's just like this uh, crescent. Yeah, this is a. It's like a crescent moon. And it's like a little little. Has like little wavy designs in it. It's really cute. I got it from Nomadic Store. I bought it because I thought it was going to be longer. I thought it was going to be a long necklace. But it's not, so that was a little bit of a disappointment. But it's still cute and I still wear it. It's, it was on sale. That's the reason why I bought it because it was on sale. I would, not, I would not have bought it if it was like full price. Okay, so now my next favorite is this little bad boy. This is Palo Alto by James Franco. Um, I actually started reading this again last year, and I didn't finish it. I think I was on either Tar Baby or Jacko, and so basically, literally almost finished, but for some reason I stopped reading it, and so recently I just started reading it again, and I'm almost finished. To me, the book was better than the movie. The movie was okay. The only thing I really liked about the movie was the actors and the cinematography. Those were on point, but... Overall, the movie was a little eh, but the book was fire. So, my next favorites are these little bad boys. This this is the Winter Candy Apple Body Lotion, the travel size, and this is the Winter Candy Apple For Your Mist travel size. And the reason I got the travel size and not the full size one is because I'm a broke ass bitch. I just didn't want to spend that much money on the full size ones. When back again, almost as much products from these. You, you feel me? Uh, so yeah, okay, so my next one, my next favorite is the NARS Orgasm Blush. I'll put a close up of it. And um, it's just my everyday blush, and I, I like it a lot. Um, for me personally, it, it's like it adds like a little, oh, I don't know how it is for everyone else, but on me personally, I just find it adds like a, a nice little shine, almost like a little bit of a highlighter thing, um, effect to it, which I really, really, really like. So it's nice. 10 out of 10. Okay, so my next favorites for November are these two little bad boys. And this one is the Kiel Style Series Cream with Silk Silk Groom. And this one is the Kiel Style Series Heat Protective Silk Straightening Cream. So basically, after I finish washing my hair, I put these two in my hair. Rather than before, before this, I put these in before I dry my hair. So while my hair is still wet, I put these in. I blow dry my hair, I straighten my hair, and then I put this one, the heat protective silk straightening cream. After I finish um, straightening my hair, I put this in again for like a little extra shine. Yeah, so these have really helped. My hair is super damaged, I have to cut it, but for now, um, I just put these in to help make my hair a little, a little bit more softer and with a nice, I mean, help it get a little more, more shine. So. Is this my last favorite? I think this is my last favorite. Okay, cool. Um, no, I have one more favorite. I'm lying. This is my second to last favorite. This favorite is the Bon Iver Forever, Forever Go, Forever Go. I used to think that his name was pro um, pronounced Bon Iver, as most people would, um, most people would think, but it's actually pronounced Bon Iver. To be honest, I, pre I prefer bon, bon Iver over Bon Iver. That's just my. Yeah, opinion. But yeah, I have listened to this album for a very long time. But um, either October or November, I got this vinyl, and um, it sounds even better on vinyl. I sound like one of those idiotic people, one of those idiotic hipsters that says everything sounds better on vinyl right now. But this album truly does sound fantastic 
on vinyl. Like, it's... It's amazing. My favorite songs on this album are Flume, Lump Sum, Skinny Love, which is one that everyone knows. Blind... No. Why that in? Team. For Emma. And then Ari Stacks. Ari Stack is probably my favorite um, song on this album, but those are just a couple of my favorites on this album. We have with the candle. Now, big one, big one, big one! And have you the um, sweater weather tag thing in the in that little jar there? Hurry up, please. This? No, in the jar, this? in the jar, in the jar on top of my dresser. This? Sweater weather. Sweater oh, weather. That's not sweat. The, the tag. I've been done on this before. Sorry. God, don't get sassy with me. Bitch. So this is this these two are my last favorites. So I have the oh ow. This one is the Yankee Candle Bay Leaf Wreath. I think this is they only have this around for the holidays, I'm not sure. But I definitely had to get a new one because as when this one when the wick was finished, I just crumpled this up. I plan on melting it down and creating another candle with the same bay leaf wreath. But for now, I'm just gonna get another bay leaf wreath, but this smells so good, it's not even funny. Like, this is probably my favorite scent of all time. And then, this, I have the, I have the, um, the plug-in thing, I totally forgot what it's called. But, um, my favorite one to use with this is Sweater Weather, which unfortunately they don't carry anymore because this, it's a false scent. But, uh, yeah, that's it. So. That's it guys, um, this, that's it for this video, hope you enjoyed it, thumbs up, subscribe, do all that good stuff, comment nice things below, yeah, so I'll be posting the November favorites music next week, hopefully I get to do that, and yeah, I'll see you guys soon, big up, much love, eat lunch because they don't want you to have lunch, I love you if you get that joke, that, that's it. See you guys later. Adios.